And today I wanted to talk about everything that I have in my medicine cabinet or that I use on a daily or weekly basis. I have a lot of stuff down here so I don't really know how I'm going to explain them all. Uh, many of them I have done a video on before. So if you have followed me, you um, would have seen uh, the videos. If not, just look at my page. If there's any oil or vitamin or whatever that you're interested in knowing more information about. If it's one that I haven't done a video on, just let me know and I will make one. Okay? So, ah, there's some that I have that I use, of course, for multiple things. And that is tea tree oil, eucalyptus oil, as well as clove oil, okay? So I've made a video on all of these except for the eucalyptus oil. The tea tree oil and eucalyptus are very good for oral care. So I do use them uh, with my toothpaste in the mornings and um, I also use them just uh, as a oil in my diffuser. I love diffusing the eucalyptus and the tea tree oil. It gives somewhat of a soothing, um, a soothing, relaxing, uh, refreshing vibe. Um, and I really like that, especially if I am worked up about something and I need to really calm down or if someone's sick in the home. Uh, those are two good oils to use. So again, I use it for oral care. I use the tea tree oils, say if someone gets a cut or um, uh, if you have a pimple on your face and, and you pop it and you want to uh, keep it um, from getting infected. You know, you're, I use tea tree oil for a lot of different things. Um, not just the oral care and the diffuser. It's one of those oils that I'll probably keep in my medicine cabinet for a very long time. Or all the time, I should say. Um, the clove oil, again, I made a video on this one. Very good for oral care. Um, I don't really use the clove oil for anything else besides that. I also have peppermint oil. These words are really tiny on the bottles, so... Um, I'll just leave a link to each of the things that I describe in the video down below in the comments. Peppermint is also good for oral care, great for using in the diffuser. Again, gives that soothing, menthol-y um, vibe or aroma in the air, okay? Uh, I have rosemary oil, which I've heard is really, really good. Um, hold on, let me just smile. It's really, really good for focus. So I should try this. I, I haven't tried it in my diffuser yet, but I should try it while I'm working just to see how that uh, works for me. But um, I know that it is used to promote uh, thinking, improving your memory, and staying awake. Okay. So now let's get to the oils that help uplift me. So that would be lemon oil. I love using lemon oil and sweet orange oil in the diffuser. It gives a very citrusy um, scent in the air uh, that helps motivate you, uplift you, you know, get you going, um, get rid of negative feelings and stuff like that. Frankincense is also a good essential oil for being uplifting. I just have two different brands. 
I must admit, frankincense does not smell too good to me. It's very woodsy, cedary, and I don't really like it. But again, I just use it for its purpose. Um, this I've also made a video on. This is Box uh, Flower Essence. This is the Gentian Flower. This is a tincture that I use for stress. When I'm stressed out, I keep it in my book bag. I can't open it right now. My hands are oily. But I made a video on this one. I just use this under my tongue. And, you know, you give it a few minutes and it will help ease your nerves and calm you down. I have neem oil, which I have used. I'm sorry made a video on and Queen Anne's Lace. I use both of these as birth control, natural birth control. If you have any questions, just send me an email or check out my other videos regarding neem oil. Of course, I have castor oil. I have about three or four bottles of castor oil in my cabinet. <laughs> This one is the uh, Jamaican Mango and Lime brand. I don't like it as much as my, um, there's another one, an, another brand that I really, really like. I don't enjoy it as much because it seems a little bit, I don't know, watery. It seems very liquidy. Not as thick as other brands that I've tried. And this is the original one, so it's not a flavored or scented one. Typically, those scented ones um, have a different consistency. But it's just this brand. I don't know what it is. Um, so, I keep plenty, plenty of castor oil in my cabinet. I use that for my hair. I use that for... Um, my face, I use that uh, for my skin. I also have black seed oil, of course. I have black seed oil throughout the house. I've made plenty of videos on that, so definitely check those out if you have any questions regarding the black seed oil. I have lavender essential oil. These are both lavender they're just different brands I use the lavender uh, to help calm me down uh, or um, I use it on my wrist to inhale or keep on me before I go to bed and I also use it in the diffusers I mix a little bit of this with the lemon or the citrus and it smells really really good I have this aguaje. I just recently received this from Madre Nature and uh, I've just been taking it for about two weeks now. So I'll keep you posted on how uh, I'm actually going to make a video on this one. I'm due to make a video on this one and um, review it and how it makes me feel. So I'll go into more information about this herb. In that video I make smoothies pretty regularly uh, a few times a week and I've made a video about wheatgrass I put wheatgrass in my smoothies I also throw in some maca which I've made a video about <laughs> and the newest thing that I've been trying lately is uh, collagen that I also throw into my smoothies. Collagen is really good for your nails and hair and promoting a healthy immune system and helping with building your muscles and your bone health, etc. And I break my nails so well, used to. I used to break my nails so easily. 
and now they don't break as, as easily, and I love that. I've been taking the collagen for, let's see, maybe um, a month now, and already I love, um, I love the effects. So, um, seems like that is all, um, that I have for you guys. If there's any essential oil or herb or vitamin that, uh, you, I mentioned in this video that you want more information on, please let me know. Leave a comment, like, subscribe, pass along and share this video with others. And until then, I'll see you next time. I actually will see you next week because I have to announce the winner of the giveaway for the black seed oil uh, that was sent to me. Madre Nature sent a couple of bottles of black seed oil and I am doing a giveaway next week. And, okay.